Hi guys, Salone here with Expanded Self Physical Therapy and Community Health, helping you expand your education and excel in physical therapy and related professions. On this channel, we interview students and practitioners offering tools, tips, and resources, which can also be found in the description area. So check that out. And also, if you're new here, consider subscribing and spreading the word. But hey, today I'm with Roland with Low Back Tracks, and he's going to explain to us how this particular device can be beneficial to clinicians in helping their clients deal with back pain. Well, the way it can help physical therapists is physical therapists see back pain every single day. They're on the front lines treating back pain. When the clinician, the uh, primary care doctor sees back pain, they don't have a lot of weapons to address it, so they send them to physical therapy. Well, now when the physical therapist treats it, they do some stretching, they do some modalities. If the patient's not getting better in a week, what do they do next? Well, a lot of times they'll go to traction, but in the offices, a lot of physical therapists use a manual form of traction where they tie belts around themselves right. and around the patients, and they actually get on the table and manually pull them in a traction method. Well, this is much easier. This you can teach the patient in a matter of 10 minutes how to do, and then they can do it on their own. Just as an example, I have a physical trainer for the sports team okay. local to us. He it's a, uh, for an AHL affiliate hockey team. Yes. And e in between every period, the, ice, the hockey players would come in and have tight backs, and he would have to manually track them. They have their skates on and everything, so he has to throw them over their shoulders and pull manually on them. And it's very ineffective use of his time because then there's 10 other people waiting for taped ankles and uh, you know other problems that are going on. So we got him to start using low back tracks. Now he hands that player the low back tracks right. he moves on he's taping someone's ankle so it's a more effective use of his time it's easier on the physical therapist they don't have to use their body right and it's easier on a patient it puts a patient in control of controlling their own pain relief and addressing their issues so if I'm hearing you correctly what you're saying is this particular device it's not something where they have to be even in the clinic to utilize. They could be taught how to properly utilize it for their condition and then maybe use it at home? Absolutely, absolutely, because this is a pain relief device. It okay. takes pressure off the joints. You know, it's FDA cleared. It's been reviewed by the FDA. So it's cleared to treat things like herniated discs and spinal degeneration and spinal stenosis and sciatica and muscle spasm. Wow. So it's cleared for all those things. So it can address painful issues. And th that this can be used at home in conjunction with physical therapy because okay. people, when they're in pain, they also get muscle imbalances and muscle weakness. Well, they still have to go to a physical therapist to retrain their muscles, but they can do the pain relief at home with this device now. That's amazing. Yeah. Guys, I'm going to get me one. Not that I'm having low back pain, but I think it could be used as a preventative method because I don't want Absolutely. it. Is that correct? Oh, yeah. Again, sports teams are using it a lot in the prevention mode. Yes. All right. Well, thank you so much. And, guys, question of the day. What did you like best about this video, and what future videos would you like to see? Connect with us in the comment section where, hey, some of the best tips and conversations are happening. So engage and become a part of the Expanded Cell community. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Also, all show notes and links will be in the description area. So check that out, and I'll see you in the next video.